Hi, I, this is a little introduction to my what I call my signature course, um, Embracing Your Brilliance. And, you know, as you can see on this page, there's eight stages to it. And I think I'm, I'm very qualified to, 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 have, to walk with you on that path, to teach you the eight stages. And I'm very committed to do that because I've been on that journey myself from a young chef who wanted to prove himself, who thought that, you know, when you're good at something, you have friends and you will be popular. That's something which started with me when I was eight years old. And of course, I can only tell you that in hindsight, because I know now my story, I connected the dots. And that will be the first step we do in your life. We're going to connect the dots. What's already there for you? Because while you're here and your purpose, the reason what you have to fulfill in life is already showing up in your life all the time. And just like in The Alchemist, the, the beautiful book by Todd Pollock, well, you, it's all within us. It's already there. And the young shepherd goes all that journey all over the world to find a treasure, to find his gold. And when he comes back to the place where he sat for many days and hours herding the sheep, he realized it was all within him. And so it is with us. And of course, this is often difficult when we're on our own journey. We don't see our own true gold. We don't see our own brilliance. So it's always good to have somebody walking with you. And then from after connecting the dots, we will go to the next step, which is establishing your foundation. What is it? What's already there? What are you doing? And where would you like to go to? And how can we build that foundation, that base from where you're going to do it all from? Because as I, you know, the, this inner path, this to shine your own brilliance and to embrace it and to live it in everything you do in your life. From, you know, I became a dad, for example, uh, on my journey, and that, that's a very important part of me. Um, we need a base for that. Um, so we establish what would you have in your life? What would you like to keep? Where would you like to go to? And what maybe do, do we have to get rid of? What do we have to let go? That could be limited beliefs, fears, sometimes concrete concrete patterns we have in our lives our hopes our disappointments because all of them made us who we are and in each and every one is a gift to grow further so that's step three which we look at those and in the you know the, the eight steps i use for this program where we go through and every step when we're ready we will go to the next one it's in our alchemy because alchemy is becoming the, the beautiful soul, who you truly are, how each and every one is born. And I discovered that cooking is alchemy, changing one substance through another, through you know a process of heating it up, of dissolving it, of getting the pure out of it, essence out of it. It's the same for ourselves. And in alchemy, there is basically seven steps to it. And those seven steps, they are aligned with our chakras. So we're following those in this program. And then after we looked at your fears and disappointments, we explore what's your gift? And that comes from your power. That's the third chakra. That's, you know, what is your true gift? What's your real power? What is unique to you, what you have to share with the world? And then the fourth step, that's, the, you know, the fifth step in our program, but the fourth chakra that's a heart, and we're going to talk about opening our heart and how to live with a heart open because each and every one has a, of us has a beautiful heart, but yet often we have it so close because of the, you know, the things we, we've happened in our life, and of course, none of us wants to be hurt. And we don't mind, you know, I don't want to get hurt, but we can deal with that, and there's ways of dealing with that. And so, then the next step is, you know, how do you communicate your purpose? That's the aligned with our throat, our throat chakra. How, how do we align with our purpose and how do we bring that into our life, into our business? So wh whether you're a lawyer and you're, you're very committed to saving the planet or the oceans, how can we combine the, the two so what you do in life and your purpose are fully aligned and how do you share that with with the world, with the people around you, with your staff, with your customers. Because there's always a way. There's always a way. And then we go to living by your intuition. That's something I really, really like myself. Because our intuition tells us everything. And we can only live that intuition when we have our heart open enough to feel it, to see it, and to believe it. And live by our heart, by our intuition, rather than what the mind tells us. 
And of course, we all have our mind, and we need our mind. When we have to be at a meeting, we need to take a train at a certain time, or get in our car to get there on time. But our intuition tells us everything else. It's things we can't know normally, and everyone can live by his intuition, is always present. And we will discover that. And then the next step, after a while when we get there, that's about bringing in consciousness. Consciousness is the wisdom of the universe. And we can tap all tap into that. And that's really the stage where true magic happens. And that magic, you know, wonders we have all in us. And we can create them at every time. I'll give you an example. I, I often ask the, the, the universe to give me insights, to give me, to tell me, Leon, what's going on here? And I always get the answer. And that's the stage I like you to, to go to as well, where we create more happiness, prosperity, and true inner power in our lives. And as we go together through these steps, I will give you all the tools, um, exercises, and, and, and maybe some other insights I have, or we, we connect with other people in order to make that um, work for you as well, and create that change in your life you truly, truly want, which we established in the beginning. And of course, it's an ongoing process. It's not step one, two, three, four, five. Sometimes we might have to go back to step three, and we will do that. So in every step, we will have a few chats. And then in between, you can have unlimited email and WhatsApp support with me. Because I'm committed, I'm really committed to make this happen. And to create that change for you. Because I've been there myself, and I would love to walk next to you. Because having someone walking next to you is very powerful very powerful and keeps you on track. I had these people around me as well. So let's create a more beautiful work together. I look forward to seeing you.